हेलो वेलकम टू ऑल यम ई थ्री आई स्टूडेंट माई सेल्फ प्रोफेसर सिंधे डेवी वर्किंग एज अ लेक्चर इन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट एस पी एम पॉलिटेक्निक कुमटे सोलापुर टूडे वी विल हैव अ लुक ऑन द सब्जेक्ट दैट इज अ कोर्स मैकेनिकल वर्किंग ड्रॉइंग द एब्रिवेशन इज एम डब्ल्यू एम द कोर्स कोड इज टू टू थ्री फोर वन नाउ वी विल लुक फॉर द प्रोग्राम आउटकम्स दैट इज पीओ पीओ वन पीओ टू अप टू द पीओ सेवन पीओ वन गिव द बेसिक एंड डिसिप्लिन स्पेसिफिक नॉलेज ऑफ द सब्जेक्ट पीओ टू गिव द प्रॉब्लम एनालिसिस पीओ थ्री गिव द डिजाइन एंड डेवलपमेंट सोल्यूशन पीओ फोर engineering tools and expectation and testing po5 will help in engineering practices for a society sustainability and environment po6 uses the project management and po7 lifelong learning program here the program means that a department mechanical is your program after studying the mechanical program you should able to achieve all these po1 to po7 now what are the course outcomes of the subject mwm that is mechanical working drawing now after studying whole mwm subject that is course first chapter will give you after studying the first chapter you can draw the development of lateral surfaces of various solids you will gain the knowledge of development of lateral surface after studying the second chapter that is intersection of solids you can draw the curves of intersections of different solids you can use various drawing codes conventions and symbols as per is sp46 you can produce a production drawing which is used in the industry you can read the production drawings which is actually practically utilized in the industry now you can also understand the component and its part its assembly disassembly okay next now what is the teaching scheme of mwm teaching scheme is tells us how many lectures you have a per week how much practical hours you have per week what is the theory content next what is your paper theory paper marks hours practicals practical marks class test marks now in this subject the board has given three lectures per week practical 4 hours per week the credit gives 7 hours to mwm in your schedule of a week now the theory paper is of 70 marks and they have allotted 4 hours to complete the paper now you have to score minimum 28 marks now the progressive assessment of the theory now we conduct the class test 1 and class test 2 both are of 20 marks now the average of these two are taken and you have assigned one project micro project the 10 marks are allotted out of 10 marks that is allotted these 20 average 20 plus 10 contributes 30 marks and out of 30 marks you will allotted the progress assessment of a theory pa now we will move to the practical the practical end semester exam is we conducted for 50 marks of whole syllabus and practical pa is of 50 marks that is allotted what we have covered in the practical the seats and assignments okay next what are the names of the topics and weightages of the topics now here the chapter is represented by the word unit now just like a department is represented by the program syllabus is represented here by the curriculum by the name of the curriculum 
and the subject is represented by the name of course. Now this course has a lesson. Instead of lesson, we have given the unit. The first unit is development of surfaces. Total hours allocated for that is eight hours, and total marks contribution to the board exam is eight marks. Second chapter, that is second unit, is intersection of solid. They are given twelve hours for that for completion, and weightage for that. Chapter that is unit is 14 marks. Third one is con conventional representation. Four hours have been given, and total six marks has been contributed. Fourth unit is production drawing. They are given eight marks for that. Ten marks have been contribution. Fifth chapter chapter is the details to assembly. They are given 16 hours. 16 hours for details to assembly as well as to assembly to details. So, both of this chapter contributes 32 marks, that is 50% of the syllabus. So, this is the contributions of each unit, each chapter for the theory paper as well as these chapters are considered for the practical work also. Now, what are the practicals? that will be conducted. We have to draw the seats and assignments for the related topic that is first development of solids, intersection of solids, conventional representation, production drawings, details to assembly and assembly to details. We have to draw minimum two seats for each chapter and assignment for each chapter. Minimum four to five problems you have to solve in the assignment. The marks will be allotted. That marks should be sent to the boards. That is the PA practical marks. Now, you have been assigned the micro project uh, samples. Jagar, you can visit to the nearby fabrication workshop and process industry to understand the industrial drawing. You can visit to our uh, college power engineering lab workshop to understand the details and assembly. So you can understand the whole that is the scenario of the drawing in the industries and you can read, interpret it, you can understand, you can convey, you can communicate it very well. Thank you. Bueno, ¿qué quieres decir?